President Bush's show of mercy for Scooter Libby is renewing calls for presidential action in the case of former Border Patrol agents Ignacio Ramos and Jose Campion. Those agents were given harsh prison sentences for shooting and wounding an illegal alien drug smuggler from Mexico. The agent's supporters are demanding a full presidential pardon. Christine Romans reports. The president decided this White House aide, sentenced to 30 months in prison for perjury and obstruction of justice, had suffered enough. I felt the punishment was uh, severe. He commuted his sentence and would not rule out a full pardon. Has a felony conviction, a $250,000 fine, two years probation, and basically has lost the way he has built a living in his, his entire life. That is a pretty significant punishment. Supporters of former Border Patrol agents Ignacio Ramos and Jose Campion are asking for the same compassion. Ramos and Campion are also convicted felons, their careers also over. They are serving sentences of 11 and 12 years for not following protocol and shooting a fleeing illegal alien drug smuggler in the buttocks. Clearly, uh, if uh, Scooter Libby deserves a, uh, a commutation, I would hope that the White House on this July 4th, tomorrow, would, part, would pardon, fully pardon, uh, Campion and Ramos. Uh, Ramos has already been beaten up in prison uh, by some of the inmates who recognized him as a Border Patrol agent. I think they've been punished enough. While the president has declared the 30-month sentence of a former aide excessive, he has let stand long prison sentences for the agents. The pardon is an exclusive power of the executive branch, and scores of lawmakers have demanded Bush add the convicted agents to the list. Bush has pardoned at least 10 convicted drug offenders, in addition to counterfeiters, embezzlers, tax evaders, and moonshiners. President Clinton pardoned 396 criminals, most famously fugitive financier Mark Rich and his own brother. This president's father was judicious with pardons, only 74, but Reagan pardoned 393. Among the 382 Ford pardons, one was for his predecessor, Richard Nixon. President Bush is being assailed by Democrats for commutation of Libby's sentence, just as Clinton was criticized by conservatives for his pardon of Mark Rich. And as only befits the Beltway, Scooter Libby Kitty was once a lawyer for Mark Rich in Washington. Thanks very much, Christine Romans. Well,